Hello friends, welcome to Gadget Gada. Today I'm here to show you a quick overview of Mi UI 10 ROM and Xiaomi Mi A1. So without further waste any more time, let's get started. Okay guys, to get started, I've installed the Mi UI 10 in my Mi A1 and as you can see here, it is running on Mi UI 10. So and you can see here my device is Mi A1 and the Mi UI version is 10.8.7.12 but the only thing is the Android version is 7.1.2 that is that means it is in now get version so most of the functionalities in Mi UI 10 is working in this ROM and I have tested out for one day and I haven't faced much of an issue with this ROM so most of the features are working like I have turned on the full screen display and if you want to move from one app to the previous app you just need to slide on right or the left of the screen and as you can see here that works fine and we will get the new recent apps tray like what we have in MIUI 10 and if you want to close any app you can just slide it to a right or left. And we also get the new style volume sliders wherein you can increase or decrease the volume of alarms, your ringer volume and your media volume. And if you go to the settings you will see exact look at what you get in a MIUI device. So it is like perfectly same like in what you get in a MIUI 10 device and you most of the features like one handed mode or like dual apps or app lock or any other features like second space or full screen gestures or buttons everything works perfectly fine i have tested out most of the things and it works pretty, pretty fine i have also tried to install the themes which is available in the me store and that too worked fine and i was able to install most of the things it will show an error that it there will be some problem with compatibility issues with this rom but still that works fine and i was able to install like most of the themes i tried like two or three themes and that was working fine i believe that most of the themes should work fine This ROM is developed by one of the senior members of XDA community and I will leave the link for that particular XDA thread wherein you can download this ROM and install it. The camera, I have tested out the default camera which comes with the ROM. The back camera is working fine and you will get good quality pictures but the front camera when I tried I was getting blurry images. I don't know what is the issue. So I tried to install the Google camera since the ROM is already rooted you can directly install the Google camera and just you can enable the build.prop and you can enable camera to API. So the Google camera is working perfectly fine and even the front camera works fine. So overall this ROM looks pretty cool and I haven't faced any issues till now but there might be bugs but still I have to use it for 2 or 3 days to find it out exactly. Still if you are a fan of MIUI you can definitely try this ROM and if you have any issues or if you find any new bugs you can just let us, in, let us know in the comment section so that we can just report it to the developer and he can fix it in the next OT update. So that's it guys that's it for the video if you like the video please hit the like button do share it to your friends and subscribe to our channel for more exciting videos so until next time bye bye.